welcome to our first project, our first home project in our new home, which is going to be building an area for our chickens. And it's going to be in this space here. Um, so the idea is to build a 10 by 15 um, foot area. We already have a chicken coop that Hector built in um, a previous video that, that I have uploaded. Um, so we have the chicken coop already, so that's nice. We, we just need to build the enclosure for the chickens. Um, so it is one of the first things we have to do because the chickens need to live somewhere and we need to move them soon. Um, so these are the posts we're going to use. Um, we have 20 of them and they're going to basically build the whole frame of the, of the structure. And then, <coughs> and then we have this, um, this wiring, uh, square wiring. It's uh, four feet high and 50 feet long. Um, I'd like to make the coop or the enclosure in a way that it's tall enough for us to go in it, but it's covered on top as well, just to protect the chickens from predators. So right now we're just kind of clearing out the area, uh, measuring where we're going to put the posts, and um, hopefully we can mostly finish it over the course of this week. We have a situation here with the fence. It is starting to lean and it needs to be reinforced a little better. So we're going to take it upon ourselves since we're building this chicken coop um, to kill two birds with one stone. We're going to build the chicken enclosure at the same time. Uh, we're going to try to support this fence a little bit. So right now we're, well Hector already dug some posts um, holes, um, and we would like to put the post right up, flush, almost flush with the fence, so that we can use it to um, support it. So we have to uh, get that cement. It's hard to see in the camera view, but we have to get that cement out of the way so we can put the post there. So Hector has actually spent most of today reinforcing the, the fence that I mentioned was falling, so that ended up taking pretty much the whole day. Um, we have to make sure that the fence is secure before we start building the coop. Um, this post here, um, this one here, is going to basically we'll be holding the whole fence up. So we're putting cement in the hole. Uh, and that, we hope that that's going to set by tomorrow so we can continue building the rest of the coop. But this is important because we need to make sure that everything is going to be strong enough to hold that fence up.
as it turns out, uh, so this is what we did yesterday with the, with the concrete. Um, this needs apparently more like a week to, um, to firm up before we can actually uh, try to try to use this post as a way to reinforce that fence. So we're just gonna let it do its thing. In the meantime, we are gonna finish up this fence um, just to make it look good. We uh, bought some more of the fence posts. So we'll be finishing the fence and, um, and uh, we'll be probably putting the posts for the chicken coop um, well, basically, we'll, 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 we'll continue working on the rest of the chicken area while that's um, still uh, setting. Um, so we'll see how much work we can get done today. It's Sunday, so it's the end of the weekend here, and we gotta we gotta get moving because we don't ha we only have a couple weeks before we have to move everything and get the renters in the other house. So uh, we'll do as much as we can today, and we'll see where we get. That's as much of the wall as we're going to get to today. Um, you can see we did that portion there um, because we still need to be holding the wall up with this um, since we are still waiting on that post or that post right there to um, fully set before we can bring the fence um, or hold the fence up with brackets we're gonna put on that post or that post <laughs> um, so we're gonna stop um, on the fence for now now we're gonna work on just um, prepping the area to put the posts which are here for the um, chicken enclosure so we were digging the uh, holes to put the posts in and we um, did something unfortunate uh, we uh, we're digging this hole and came across this and accidentally broke the casing for the wiring that goes underneath here for these lights that are um, those lights. And We're a little set back because we have to repair that before we can continue. Um, this is the coop that doesn't want to be made, I guess. We dug out what was messed up and Hector's patching it up. The wire was not, the insulation in the wire was not touched, not damaged. It was just the conduit that that broke. So this is a way of doing it. Some PVC wrap tape, I don't know what you want to call it. Like we don't want to some. Like you knew we were gonna do this. <laughs> you knew that we were probably gonna yeah. mess up this, this um, setup. But uh, this should take care of it. Now we have to be very careful and not to do this again because we're probably gonna have wires running along that area there for that post so we just have to be careful um i think we're done for today this took a little longer than i thought it was going to i thought we were gonna i thought we were gonna pretty much finish the enclosure this weekend and that didn't happen because of little hiccups but that's okay uh, we have almost all the posts up I think we just need one more and then we can start um, doing the, the wiring for like the fencing um, and I think we're tired right 
ready to go home. Yeah, because this isn't even our home yet. <laughs> If this is our home, we could just go inside. In all the chaos of moving, we didn't prioritize filming, finishing the coop uh, or the enclosure. And uh, it's, I would say, 80% completed right now. We really just needed to get the chickens in here. And um, I was really worried about predators, not having a roof. I haven't had an issue so far, so let's just hope that it stays that way. The intention is um, to put not... Um, a fully covered roof but kind of like a, a pergola style uh, with um, kind of beams going across and maybe like a mesh uh, roofing which we'll probably do uh, later because we have a lot of other things we need to do right now but this is the completed um, or semi-completed um, enclosure so we did put the wiring and um, we moved the coop um, inside. Uh, we put it on some cement blocks just to raise it up a bit. And uh, it's the same coop from a previous video, but I just wanted to show what it looks like. Uh, I access the eggs from back here. Looks like we got a few eggs there. And then my food is here. For and I would like to develop watering system but right now we just don't have the, the time to do that since it's not a tremendous priority but that's what it looks like right now and I hope that in the future when we finish it I'll take a, a, a video and uh, post it later um, it's kind of not the way I imagined it I wanted it to look a lot more aesthetic um, but it works and it's functional and the chickens are loving it.